Windows 10 has free built-in video game screen recording, and I'm going to show you how to do it. Hey there all you random people, I am Hology, and today I'm going to show you how to record your screen in video games on Windows. This feature is built in and exclusive to Windows 10, and you can get it for free in most games. Now, if you play things often, you may have noticed that there is this gray box that appears at the bottom of supported applications every once in a while, and if you're smart you'd probably read them and pay attention because they actually show you a lot of useful things. In this case, this one showed me the same notification that I'm just going to tell you about right now. The Windows key combo, Windows G. Now, if the application supports it, you'll see a bunch of controls here at the bottom. This is the game capture and record screen, built into Xbox games in Windows 10. Now, if I were you, I'd first go into the little settings things over here. Click on Go to the Xbox app to see more settings. You may need to sign in to get any farther than this, if you haven't already. Now that you're in the settings, there's a whole bunch of things that you can change, including how to start and end recording, special key combos for that. For instance, the default key combo for taking a recording is Windows Alt R to turn on and off screen recording. Also, if you scroll down right here, you can change the maximum recording time if you just want to make sure that you don't overwhelm your computer. You can also go down over here to change the video encoding quality or video resolution from standard to high. Keep in mind that this will affect your game performance and will take up a significantly larger amount of space on your computer. You can also go under Saving Captures and click Open Folder. This will open the folder that your game recordings are saved to, but I'll show you how to get to that in a moment. You can close this out. And once like said, Windows key G, and you can just simply click on the record button down here to start recording. And as you can notice, the game bar will disappear, and you're now recording the game's content. It should as well record audio. You notice that there's a little red bar up in the upper right hand side of the screen. That should not appear in the recording. It just signifies how much time you've been recording for. Once you're done doing what you're doing, you go back to Windows G and click Stop on the recording. A notification should pop on the computer showing you that clip has been recorded. And if you click on it, it'll go back to it and you can view or edit and modify it. Now, if you want to access the video clips, you can do this one of two methods. My favorite, of course, is using the File Explorer. Open any open folder, and on the pane on the left, go to this PC. Go to Videos, and then Captures. Here your game DVR should be saved. Double-clicking on it will, of course, open it, and you can view the clips. This, of course, being the video that I just recorded with you a moment ago. As you can see, it actually works quite well. The quality may be a bit degraded. Of course, this is to save game performance and space on your computer. But just the fact that you can get this for free is pretty neat. The second way, of course, is by going to the Start menu, searching for Xbox if you don't have it pinned already, opening the app, of course of which you can do all sorts of things in. On the pane on the left, go to the section called Game DVR. This should be right below the trophy icon on the left. Here, it'll show you all the different recordings you have on this PC. You can rename them, trim them, delete, share them, or open the folder they came from. Or simply just view them. Thank you so much for watching this video. I am Hology, and I'll see you next time.